All right, we're gonna do a video for the best bat for an 11 year old. Those who've seen our other videos on Just Bat Reviews will realize that we have about, you know, I don't know, 100 bats or so. We had our 11 year old and our older son come out and try to find their best bats of all those 100 bats or so. Um, they found, at least for the 11 year old, here's, here were his top five um, after hitting with just about everything we have from, you know, Rawlings and Easton and Combat and DeMarini and Rip It and you name it, it's on the list. So we're gonna take these top five and do a little hit off uh, here into the cage and see which, which can get the highest bat speed out of these top five. That's the CF8 drop eight, the CF7 drop five, the Combat drop 10, the Maxim, the new one, the 5150 from Rawlings and then the Bomb uh, from uh, Combat, the old school one. Um, is, is this determining the best bat? Uh, well, some people might claim that. I don't necessarily, because all we're measuring here is the best single hit off of a tee. What I think most great hitters want is actually uh, the bat that gives them the, the most consistency with great hits, not just the single greatest hit. But regardless, that's not necessarily fun to measure uh, on a YouTube video. So for fun, we're going to see which one of these five bats with very similar baseballs, same branded baseballs, can get us the hottest, uh, uh, the hottest ball exit speed here today um and as he goes through his constant stretching to hit uh we'll uh we'll get rocking and rolling here all right so this is the b2 single piece composite da bomb uh not legal in all leagues but legal in some fun to hit here we go right in the net 57 all right missed maybe a little bit let's try to hit one right into the net 57 is a good place to start that's a nice one. 57 it is. All right, next bat. So the Combat B2 comes in with uh, 57 miles an hour. All right, what are you going with next? Uh, 5150. All right, the 5150 from Rawlings. This is the new uh, 2016 version. So this is really a three-piece bat with that extended end cap, like the Velo, the Velo, sorry, and the uh, composite and handle and aluminum barrel. Here we go. Oh, missed it. 52 miles an hour. You're on a tee here. No excuses, buddy. Got to drill it right here. Hit the gov. Nice. Ooh, only 51. It looks like a little bit of an end cap hit. Let's try it one more time. I know the combat's a pretty hot bat, but is it that hot? I want to find out. Drive through it. Here we go. 56. That seems more like it. All right. Three hits is the max, so... It's a legitimate second place at the moment. All right, here comes the Combat Maxim. Gigantic barrel on this bat. This is the 2016. This is 2 and 5 eighths drop 10. This is a 3121. Uh, fun bat to hit if you've never hit this bat. The barrel on this thing is just gigantic. All right, here we go. 56. All right, see one more. Let's give it at least a double. There we go. Fifty-six. All right, next guy. All right, here is the De Marini CF8. So this is 2016, of course. Um, this is the CF8, uh, the CF8 Drop Eight. Fifty-six. All right, there we go. Fifty-six. See if you can be fifty-six. 56 no dice all right clearly some consistency across the board in these bats no surprise there right these are all at the end of the day high performance composite bats all right what we got now CF7. all right this is the drop five cf7s this is 2015's version this is actually a 25 ounce bat um here we go see if we can beat 56 swing and a miss 47 but a miss hit for sure Eh, 51, but you still haven't hit it well yet. Fifty-six. <laughs> Not surprising, right? I mean, these are all high-performance composite bats. Uh, the only bat that seemed to beat the other ones was the bat that uh, that turns out is slightly illegal in a handful of leagues. This is the B2. 
but everything else was 56, 56, 56. Um, you had a, yeah, you had a two-piece uh, hybrid bat in the 5150, a single-piece composite, and then two two-piece uh, um, composite bats in the CF8. Again, these are the the single best hit off of these bats. Um, what bat gives you the best, you know, chance to hit it? What bats gives you the best chance to get to that maximum speed? Those are things you can only figure out in game and in a cage.